Welcome to the BYU Test Generator tutorial. While you can build tests directly in Blackboard, this is sometimes excessively time-consuming. There are some third-party tools that can help streamline this process. The option covered in this tutorial, BYU Test Generator, is free and is web-based, allowing you to use it on any computer with Internet access. While it does not have as many features as Respondus, it will suffice for most instructors. In this tutorial, you will learn how to properly format a Word document for use in the BYU Test Generator, how to create a text document for Blackboard Upload, and how to upload the text document to the Test, Survey, or Pool Manager for use in your Blackboard course. First, you must properly format a document according to question type. You will be provided a link to instructions and a sample document. One of the most common question types is multiple choice. True or false questions use the same formatting, but there are only two choices. Multiple answer questions are similar, but there can be more than one correct answer. By learning this one format, you can now create three question types. As you can see, a question number is provided along with the question text. Below, you will list the possible answers and place an asterisk to the left of the correct answer or answers. It is important that you use the formatting exactly as illustrated. Review the formatting instructions for each question type that you will use and create your document. The second step is to use the BYU Test Generator to create a properly formatted text file that Blackboard understands. You will be provided with a link to this tool which resides online. This allows you to create your text files from any computer with Internet access. You will copy the text from your source file and paste it into the BYU Test Generator. Next, click the button that says Save as Text File. You will be prompted to open or save the file. Select Save and browse for the location where you want to save the file. Include a file name and click Save. Before using this file in Blackboard, open the text file and check for any obvious errors. In the left column, there should be acronyms for the type of questions for each item. If you see question marks, there is a formatting issue which requires you to return to the Word document to troubleshoot and then resubmit with the BYU Test Generator. If there are no obvious problems, you are ready to move to the final step. Navigate to the course where the test survey or pool will reside. Under Control Panel, open the Course Tools menu and click Tests, Surveys, or Pools. If your questions are intended to be a pool which can be used in more than one test or survey, select the Pools link. If the questions are intended for a specific test, select the Tests link. If the questions are part of a survey which is not graded, select the Survey link. At this point, you might be tempted to use the Import button, but do not use this feature as the question upload will fail. Select the Build button. Provide a name for the test survey or pool. And a description if you like. You can return to this area later and make changes. Click Submit.
Now you will see three buttons. Select Upload Questions. Browse for the text file created with the test generator and select it. Apply points per question, which can be changed later, and click Submit. When the test generates, you will see the questions displayed along with the question type and default points. Your test survey or pool is now ready for use with your Blackboard course and you should proceed as you normally do to deploy the assessment and apply settings. In review, to use the BYU Test Generator for creating test surveys or pools for Blackboard, you must follow three steps. Properly format your questions in a document, copy and paste the text into the Test Generator, and upload questions into a Blackboard test survey or pool.